Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, as promised, I am going to be looking at the new 4th of July update things and fixing a few things about my home for summer. So without further ado, let's get straight into build mode. I also wanted to decide on something for the roofing here because I have not decided on anything yet. So let's look up some of the roof textures. I thought on metal roofing, but then I kind of liked the idea of keeping it plastic. So maybe we could do like a darker. I don't like my home to be that dark. I think a medium gray uh, would actually work pretty good with the home overall, so we might just keep it like that, but I will let you guys know later. So, <clears throat> this is my house right now. I do still have my Valentine's Day decorations up, because it has been a long time since I played Bloxburg. So, let's put all of that in my inventory. And, yeah, so... Let's see, we can put this, and this, and that, and that. And my inventory. I also have a couple Valentine's Day things for here. That, and that all super cute all right now that that stuff is all taken care of let's come back here and look at this little pond we have so i started here with a bunch of this bush but i feel like we could definitely change it up a little not that i don't like this bush i just feel like it's boring to keep the same bush around the whole pond actually i like how that bush was there right there And then, same kind of with this over here. We could do like. Maybe. Hmm. I have my advanced placing on. Uh, yeah, I'm not really sure. Let's look into our garden. See, we could like put some. It's hard to place this. Okay, uh, we could overlay with like a couple mushrooms here and there. Wildflowers, those could be cute. Oh, right there could work as a spot. And we could put like some other bushes. Tropical leaves plant. I really like this. This is new, actually, in our new update. And we've got a couple other things. Uh, yeah, so I think this is. Oh, uh, that's kind of weird. We have some grass coloration right here that's off. That might be like a glitch, but look, it's like two different. Huh. Oh, I also have this. It's like, okay. I don't know, but yeah, I think the pond looks a little better now, but uh, we can go ahead and add a, like, I don't know, outdoor garden thing. Of course we have all of these, but we could do like an event tent. I wish you could like resize this to be a little bit smaller, because I don't want to do these, because they look really like, 
cheap, but the event tent is just so, so big. And I feel like it'd be nice to have something a little bit smaller um, <clears throat> for our 4th of July setup. Let me see if I can make the pop-up canopy tents look any cuter here. So, if we placed, like, two, and then we use, like, lily white, we could make them look a little cuter that way. Maybe since this is institutionally matched, that looks a little bit better, so we can do all the same coloration for there. And then we could add like some string lights. Let's look. String lights. Uh, there's the hearts, those. Let's do spherical string lights. Wait, can you standard place these on here? No, okay. Looks like we'll just have to do custom placement. Okay. Oh, this is cute. Okay. Well, that is perfect. And we can just like, and then same over here. Boom. We've got quite a few string light things now, which is nice. These are gonna be so cute. Okay. Um and then Boom. Okay, we have a little cute Fourth of July setup right there. That is perfect. Okay. Now let's look at tables. <clears throat> Maybe we can find like some cute outdoor tables. Ooh, folding table. Perfect. Uh, we can do like a couple of, oops, I accidentally just got rid of that. Okay, uh, folding. <coughs> And there we go, we can put like one right there and one right there. And then we could put like something in the middle, like a little, we could put a different folding table in the middle and it could be like that. And then we can scooch these tables over just a little bit like that. And now this could be like where all the food is and we can have our like areas right here. So I set these uh, tables up to look a little more festive. I put some colorful confetti poppers here, which I think I'm actually going to make blue like that. Oh, no, don't do that. Okay. Dang it. <laughs> I almost turned our little, like, firework thingy blue all the way. Uh, <clears throat> we can have a little, a couple picnic blankets maybe over near the pool. We have the hot tub, of course. And this little gazebo I might set up as like a little chill spot. So, yeah, and I think I might bring out like some of the uh, things like the sidewalk chalk and the bubbles. And I might put those on the table over here, but I'm also going to put some food out. So let's do that. I made some hot dogs. Just making some different foods. Right now we're doing uh, chili. Oh.
and yeah. So that's cool. Oh, that's a cute little email of um my avatar like trying the chili or whatever. Okay, well, I think our little 4th of July setup is pretty much complete, and I can't wait to make a live stream on the 4th of everybody enjoying this. So that'll be super duper fun. Oh, I guess I got on top of that. And let's dive in the pool and try out this new hot dog that we got. Woo! Because that is super, <gasps> that's so cool. I love this. Wait, okay. I love that new hot dog float. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And make sure to like and subscribe so you can hop on that live stream on the 4th. Bye.